Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with Jaspie's 11 box Toys for Tots Baseball Random Team Mixer. All cards ship and the proceeds going to the Tots. So you can go to jazbeescasebreaks.com, you can see all the details right there. Um, I think each break that we fill, yeah, the total of the five breaks that you're purchasing, thank you very much for helping the Tots, I think the net profits are going to be $2,500. That's how we kind of priced it out. And then on top of that, from what you have contributed, right, Jaspies is throwing in another $2,500 to make it $5,000 worth of toys for the tots. So thank you very much for, uh, for helping out the kids. We appreciate that this holiday season. Especially these people right here. Big thanks to these folks right here. Thanks for helping the tots. We appreciate that. All 30 baseball teams are in. Now let's do the break. Let's roll it and randomize it. Two and a two, four times for each list. Hard four. One, two, three, and four. After four times, we've got Sam down to James. No, oh, I don't even have, that was from a different mixer. I don't even have... I spread you. I was so eager to start this Someone Toys for Tots that break. If you join the Toys for Tots breaks, mm -hmm. that like future, maybe the rest of the month or something, you'll get like Breaking God Mojo. That's Whoa. What that, I'm, I'm not promising that. They're Breaking Gods. Till that no, the break, right. It's just good karma. Good holiday karma. Breaking karma. Breaking karma. All right. Sam down to James. There you go. Sam down to James after four times. Uh, hard four for the teams. One, two, three and four fourth and final time we've got white Sox down to the brew crew in this 11 box break all right sam with the white Sox, dj with the mets brent with the rockies matthew you got my dodgers james with the rays Toby with the Strohs, Richard with the Reds, Derek with the Diamondbacks, Seth with the Marlins, Paul with the Yankees, Chris with the Padres, Seth with the Indians, Zach Gwynn with the Orioles, Zach Paul with the Rangers, two Zachs back-to-back, -back. James with the Last Spot Mojo, star next to your name, Blue Jays, Kevin with the Cubs, Matt with the A's, Mark with the Angels, Kip with the Pirates, Payne with the uh, Nats, Kevin with the Twins, Chris with the Royals, Darren with the Phillies, Chris with the Cardinals, Charles with the Braves, James with the Giants, Richard with the M's, Josh with the Bo Sox, Tyler with the Tigers, and James with the Brew Crew. Let's sort this. Uh, let's get all this on one page and sort this by column B by team. And let's, uh, let's create our spreadsheet here. Today's the eighth. Uh, and this is Jaspie's 11 box. Toys for Tots Baseball Mixer. It's a random team break. All right, and just as a quick, before you start trading. Oh, I guess, look at the picture. That's what's that's what's in here. I don't know which, which uh, on-demand box is that? Is it the dual auto one? That on-demand box is the, uh, is the dual auto one. actually has a pretty great checklist all right i'm going to pause the video when we come back we're going to see if there's any trades and then the break stick around all right welcome back folks a little bit of trade chatter but in the end no deals were done on this tuesday tuesday toys for tots baseball mixer thanks everyone for getting in appreciate it here is a small example by the way of the of the car that we loaded up that's actually when we took out half of it we did two car loads full of toys for the tots. I think we're, we're going to end up doing one big, collect them all together and do one big uh, photo and stuff like that. But that's just an early example of the, of the holiday shopping that we've been doing. Thanks to you. So thanks everyone for joining those Toys for Tots breaks on jazbeescasebreaks.com. Jack, what's up? So your contribution by joining those breaks, folks, is uh, 
is uh, twenty five hundred two thousand five hundred dollars. And Jaspi's matches that we slap on another two thousand five hundred dollars off of that. It's five thousand dollars worth of toys for the tots. I guess these are the exclusives. I'll do that a little bit later. All right. And I think we're, we're requirements here. All cards ship in this, so everything you see here, you're going to get. So all the maybe variations that I might have passed by or whoever, they will ship. There's Sutsugo, Chrome, Bobachet Rookie, and a nice Randy Arozarena out of this update. Blast Blaster box, I guess. Andrew McCutcheon. That must be a variation, right? There you go. There's your AL Rookie of the Year. We got Manny Machado. Got he got his face right there on, on on the coin. That's pretty cool. What am I watching? We're watching uh, we're watching Tuesday night football. Yeah, right, Rex. I mean, listen, we we had, we had a pretty good year. We we're fortunate enough to. To have some good business, so we want to be able to share that with the tots as well. We have come a long way, that's for sure. I remember this old Cooperstown says, this is from, what year are you from? 2012. Let's see, let's see, let's see what we got in here. Thanks, Rex. Really? I feel like a lot of I feel like a lot of breakers do that. They don't. Some of the bigger name ones don't. They must. Well, if not, right, right, right. There, there's no other breakers, right? That's what, that's what we meant. Yeah, 
Yeah, that's right, Kyle. There's no other breakers. We're the ones that figure this out. We're the only ones that do this. All right. Cooperstown time. There's Ty Cobb, two ninety nine. I guess he used to be able to win a trip ba back in the day. That's kind of cool. Bring that back. I don't know if there's even hits. Are there hits in this? One on-card Cooperstown signature in every box. That's what it says. Museum pieces, Al Kaline's gold glove. Cooperstown, that's a, that's a place, that's a place I want to go to. I don't know. I mean, I don't know how old they they get. They seems to be pre Rockies old guys. But maybe the, I don't know. Who knows? Maybe they'll throw in an Andres Galarraga in here somewhere. Or maybe it's just Cooperstown guys. Probably just Cooperstown guys. But I don't think the Rockies got anyone in Cooperstown until recently. That's a nine ninety nine. Oh, and there's our autograph right there, Jim Rice to five ninety nine. Don't worry, Brent. It's just it's just one box out of eleven. You'll have plenty of other rocky opportunities here. Uh, that'll be for the. Does it say Red? It should say Red Sox on here, right? Yeah. You only doesn't. It's not super clear, but yeah, it's for Boston. Jack, are you asking me if I like the Cowboys? You're asking me if I like the Cowboys? Surely not. No, I mean, I like football, so that's why I'm watching the game. King Kelly? Come on. Old King Kelly. Michael Joseph King Kelly was also known as the $10,000 beauty. Based on the then record price, Boston paid to Chicago to acquire his services after he won a batting title, hitting 388. Back in 1886. Good old, good old King Kelly. Uh, let's do some Allen and Ginter Chrome edition. You know what? I should probably look that up, right? I'm assuming he's a Boston Red Sox. Old King Kelly.
I mean, in 1886, it would be the Boston Bean Eaters, which turned into... I mean... Turn to the Boston Braves? Yeah, I actually think he's a Boston Brave. And the, it, the team that traded him with was, was the Chicago White Stockings. No, the Rice was Jim. That, that we know is Red Sox. I think it actually goes to the Boston Bray. <laughs> this this one random King Kelly card. We'll, we'll send it to the Braves. That goes to Charles. All right. Let's pop this open. Now there are some non Baseball, we sold that. We had that non-baseball spot here. If any non-baseball cards, will go to uh, will go as one lot to one person in the break. Cowboys are keeping this game close, ladies and gentlemen. So yeah, so many so these are like the non sport cards right here. The scorpion fly. Scorpions are scary enough without them flying. No thanks. There's Kampala, the a booming city. And we've got a green Wade Boggs to ninety nine. Another mini card right here, Colton Wong. Starling Marte. Another bug card, bugging out. The old world swallowtail. I'm, I'm okay with this butterfly, that's fine. Scorpion fly, no thanks. All right, there, there it is. A hyena Mufasa. Hey. Bryce Harper mini. Yeah, I, I like I like Ginter. It's always always a fun quirky set. Riley Gold, seven out of fifty. So those are a couple non baseball players there. Got another booming city in Shenzhen. Another bug, the bumblebee. Bumblebee's fine, I guess. There's Bucky Lasik, 63 out of 99. 
Babe Ruth mini. And we've got a zebra. What else? What else? Should we go ahead and do this? This mega box here? Sure. I don't know. What is that Dallas kicker doing? I mean, that's it's good for you though, Kyle. Didn't you didn't you lay the points with with Baltimore? You must have received your payment. Yeah, I think, and Tucker missed one earlier today, too. I know this is a baseball break, folks, but. Not a lot of baseball happening right now. Hot stove has been kind of cold. Has there been any? I saw, I saw like Lance Lynn signed. I don't think there was anything too crazy. Oh, Royals signed Carlos Santana. White Sox got Lance Lynn. They got Adam Eaton back too. Oh, here that Reds traded Reds traded Rice Iglesias to the Angels. That's some good bullpen help for them. I mean, nothing too, nothing too crazy. Yeah, I heard that stat, Michael. I couldn't believe it. It's a facsimile autograph, by the way. Yeah, I saw that stat. Justin Tucker's missed his first field goal under 40 yards. He had hit like 70, 71 in a row or something like that. Crazy. And as you noticed, a couple nice Aaron Judge rookie cards here. Paul Hutchins has the Yankees. You got the Aaron Judge hyper. Nice. And the Aaron Judge base rookie card. Are these, these are the exclusive X-Fractor cards. Guriel, Sanchez, Kinsler, Maurer, and Ryan Healy. Got five more right here. Piscotti, Addison Russell, Gary Sanchez, Aaron Judge, X Fractor, nice. That's pretty cool. A base, base rookie Judge and two parallels. Be worth grading those out too. Let's get into some 2012 Bowman baseball. Oh, Bryce Harper and Garrett Cole in here. Should we save this? Maybe save this till later? Add, add the suspense to this box right here. What about Leaf Ultimate Baseball? What if those aliens, Israeli, the Israelis, but former defense minister was talking about, are real? If they were real, and they were here, take over group breaking. Sure, just just cut me in on it. If they could pay me in like, I don't know, some some like crazy. Uh, let's 
some crazy mineral from their home world. Nick Lodolo is a red, Cincinnati Reds. That'll be for Richard Miller. There's Josh Wolf. Oh. Sorry if I woke up your dogs. Josh Wolf. Soccer player, uh, there's Josh Wolf, soccer player. Josh Wolf, baseball? Mets, I think. Yeah, drafted in 2019. All right, he's with the Mets. That'll be for DJ. We got five out of ten. Jack uh, Kakanowitz. I don't know where he goes. Jack is, was drafted by the Angels in the third round of the 2019 June draft. Obviously, these guys are like kind of wait and see sort of players here. Mark Nation with the Halos. We got Michael Toglia. I think he's a uh, Yankee, is he? Or a or a Rocky? Michael Toglia is a Rocky, Colorado. There you go. We got the we got Brent on the board. Hopefully it turns out to be amazing. Let's go, Mike. We've got Jimmy Lewis. Jimmy Lewis sounds like a, a Red Sox to me. Jimmy Lewis, not 1907 Jimmy Lewis, not 1923 Jimmy Lewis. Are they all related? Jimmy Lewis the third. I wonder if they're all related to those Jimmy Lewis's. Jimmy Lewis, third baseball? Is he a Dodger? Yeah, he must be drafted in 2019. He's a Dodger. All right, let's go Dodgers. That <laughs> goes to Matthew. I don't think he has any stats yet. Still pretty young, I guess. And back here, we've got, I think this is Braves. 15 out of 15, Christian Robinson. I think is a pretty big prospect for the Braves. Let's see. Sounds like a Brave. No, Diamondback. All right, that goes to Derek Riley and the Arizona Diamondbacks. There you go. Let's get another Leaf box going here. So this is 2020 Leaf Ultimate Draft Baseball. Oh, these are the ones that come out of here. All right, we got Everson Pereira, 70 out of 75. I think he is, I'm gonna say Yankee. He is.
He only has like, the highest he got. He's still he's only 19. Did some uh, did some low A for the Yankees. So might be coming up the ranks. That'll be for Paul. We got Edward Cabrera. Edward Cabrera is a Marlin. It goes to the fish. That'll be for Seth. We got Connor Phillips. Base auto. XRC. Possible parallel in there, too. Connor Phillips is a Mariner. And that'll be for Richard and the M's. We, oh, we've got two here. We've got Evan Carter, 74 out of 75. Well, that's a touchdown. Evan Carter, wait for it, is a Texas Ranger. That'll be for Zach Paul and the Texas Rangers. There's Geraldo, Geraldo Perdomo, two out of five. Good catch, Marquise Brown. You get feet in? Yeah, sure did. I think Perdomo is a Diamondback, is my guess. There's his name. Made a minor league. Yes, Diamondbacks. Was it? Was he with? Was he with the big club? No. That'll be for Derek Riley. And I think we know where this guy goes. Nice one for the Braves, Ronald Acuna. Yeah, are they playing? They should. They should have played a Jackson Brown song going into the commercial break. Right, Lamar Jackson to Marquise Brown, Jackson Brown. Maybe a little, uh, little, little doctor, my eyes. That would have been a good one. There must be some other <laughs> other Jackson Brown songs that are pretty good. It's a missed opportunity. Running on Empty, I think, is a Jackson Brown song. Yeah. Yeah, Running on Empty would have been pretty good. Let's check out what the rip cards here. All right, now these rip cards, we're just gonna, we're gonna send unripped, so it'll be the team that's on the front. Whatever the team is, and we'll leave you to rip it if you want to. This packaging is kind of terrible here. All right, 24 out of 99, there's Walker Bueller for the Dodgers, Matt Subblefield. So you can see, kind of hard to see, but you can see the rip tab right here. Tear if you dare. There's Rafael Devers to 99. That'll be for Josh Melton and the Red Sox. Tear if you dare. We got out of 50, Kirby Yates 
37 out of 54, the Padres. That's going to go to Chris Miller. Tear if you dare. Craig Biggio, 2 out of 25 for the Astros, Toby Wilds. What's under the, these rip cards? A mini card. So it'd be about this size right there. So that's what's inside. It could be a mini base card, an exclusive image variation, or a mini autograph. Obviously autographs are kind of rare. All right. What else should we do? Should we do this? Let's do this on demand. On the on the thumb notches here, which makes it Oh wait, doesn't it just tear off right here, maybe? Oh Oh now I cut it, oh I just made it worse. right there there's a red parallel right here dynamic duels we'll go uh, left right randomizers on these by the way this will be a separate left right randomizer and this, Phillies, no, no randomizer on this. Steve Carlton and Mike Schmidt, both Phillies. Nice. And Darren Schmidt, getting the Mike Schmidt. You spell it slightly differently, but there you go. Nice. All right, let's do some Topps Chrome Black. There's Bruce Star Gratterall, Tony Gonsolin, both champions, and Josh Bell. And the encased card is going to be for the Orioles. That's Miguel Tejada for the O's. Nice. 119 out of 150. There you go. That'll be for Zach Wynn and the O's. All right, we'll do this last. We can play America's Favorite Game, Who Am I? So get your thinking caps on. We'll do a quick recap at the end here. Now let's get into some 2012 here. Look how young Bryce Harper looks right there. There's Garrett Cole. Are they, how are they 
Was one a different number one draft pick? Wait, what year was Bryce drafted? <laughs> We're guaranteed an autograph out of here, but we'll see here. Good luck. Yeah, right. I mean, to be like, uh, It'd be like uh, Back to the Future all over again. Jock Peterson, Addison Reed, Tulowitzki, Chris Paddock was a, oh no, that's someone else, Chris Redder, someone else. Where's Scott Rowland? No, we're not going to see again. I'm, I'm just kind of looking carefully to make sure I'm not missing, like, the Bowman first card of a big name, but not seeing any at the moment. Yeah, I do remember when Mark Trumbo was supposed to be a big star. Kind of cool, actually. The Anthony Anthony Rendon Bowman first for Payne Huang and the Nats. I don't know what this goes for, but he's a pretty good player. Could grade that out too. Look how he looks so. Look how young and skinny he looks here. Scouting report: blasted 52 homers at Rice, consensus college player of the year, national freshman of the year. Skills: combines great fielding skills at third with potent lumber. Stuns with amazing bat speed. Makes great play look routine. Yeah, looks like the you can check mark all that. Yep, yep, yep. Sharp eye at the plate. Yeah, so ticks the boxes. All right, let's see what's in this box. All right, 
who am I? He is currently, he's still with us. He's 82 years old. Lifetime 290, 2,711 hits, 426 home runs, 1,475 runs batted in. I am a Hall of Famer, sixth ballot Hall of Famer with 85.71% of the votes, a six-time All-Star, an NL Rookie of the Year, an NL Batting Champion, my number 26 re retired by the team I played for the longest. I spent the last two years of my career with Oakland, with the Oakland A's in 1975 and 1976. But before then, I uh, played for one other team. That's it. Ooh, Michael Stewart, I think you got the, uh, you got the city right, but not the team. I think Baines was a White Sox for a little while, right? This is a Cub. And he was inducted in 1987. There you go. Jack's got it. How'd you get that, Jack? Nice. Yeah, it's Billy. I'm going to flip screens for a second. It's Billy Williams. There he is. Old Cub Billy Williams. I didn't realize Billy Williams hit 426 home runs. There it is. Cubbies. That's for Kevin Benedict. There's the Beckett sticker right there, the Beckett card inside there. There's his autograph. Nice. Great penmanship. There you go. Nice. Batted left and threw right. I was like, asking Jack how he got it. He's like, well, I'm old. Yeah, I think I think I think a lot of people have fond memories of of uh, Billy Williams in the '60. He played. He went from '59 to '74 with the Cubs. So the entire '60s and half the '70s. Once again, Kevin Benedict with that one. I think I read this. Uh, did I audio audio book Ned Coletti's autobiography about his life in the front office of baseball? He's a Chicago guy. And uh, he praises him and... Uh, right, he praises him, Ron Santo, and the Let's Play 2 guy. Yeah, Bernie <laughs> Banks. All right, we got a few randomizers to do. So let me set that up. All right, so the first one will be for the for those animal bug cards out of Ginter. Name on top will get it. Second one will be the left-right randomizers from the on-demand. And then the red parallel will do separately as well. Vlad Guerrero Jr., Toronto, Pete Alonzo, New York Mets. All right. I don't have to randomize anything else, right? No, I think I'm good. All right, one dice roll for those three lists. And we'll go one and a four five times. Another missed field goal? Oh, bad day for Zerline. One, two, three, four, and a one. Fifth and final time. After five, those little mini... And, and there, some, there were some other non-baseball cards in there, too. It's DJ. DJ Altergut with the non-baseball cards out of Ginter. So there you go. Five times for left-right. One, two, three, four, and fifth and final time. Uh, that'll be right-side card. We'll get those. And then five times. One, two, 
three, four, and the red parallel goes to Toronto. That's going to go to James. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, thanks for helping out the Tots by getting into this break. That was the 11 box Toys for Tots baseball mixer. We appreciate you contributing for the holidays. Thank you very much. Happy holidays. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next one.